Hey, hello, you're stuck in traffic for quite a few minutes riffing on IT and IT security. Today, looking at confirmation bias. You know, my threat models for WannaCry, my threat models for Notpedia, um, both of those threat models begin with one path that shows a phishing exercise. Now, if you've been paying attention, you go, wait, 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 wait. WannaCry was scanning, right? It was a worm that was propagating. And hey, Natpedia, wasn't that ME Docs? Wasn't that an ME Docs update that started all this? Yes. But whenever I don't show phishing and I just jump to those stages, people are like, wait, Wolf, you forgot phishing. We should talk about phishing controls. Why? Confirmation bias. <laughs> so, tip to you be very careful uh, about what you think you know. Be very careful about confirming your own hypothesis about what happened. Be very careful about the way the mind works. Because the way mind works is it gathers evidence, it gathers information all the time that confirms how it thinks the world works. And if that information about how the world works is not at hand, you begin to think, well, maybe I'm not getting the right information, right? You begin to think, well, maybe this threat model is wrong, or maybe this article is not covering the full things. We see things as human beings that aren't there. You have to be in the habit, the pattern, the discipline of looking for things that don't match what we think, that don't match how we think the world works, that are surprising, that are unexpected, that are unique, that are weird and strange and make for good stories and good conversations. We have to be in a good discipline for looking for those things because it's those things that are on the edges, it's those things that are on the outliers, it's those things that are the leading indicators of where our security program needs to be focused in and needs to be playing at. Otherwise, we continuously fight last year's battle, or yesterday's battle. Got a good story for me about confirmation bias? Hit me up on social media or on uh, comments. Cheers.